a very quick update on the flooding in Auckland. As you'll have heard, thunderstorms and heavy rain in the early hours of this morning has caused severe flooding and damage in parts of West Auckland. As at 10am this morning, Fire and Emergency New Zealand had responded to roughly 370 incidents involving mostly flooding, power lines down and trees down. Auckland Emergency Management is undertaking preliminary reconnaissance in the affected areas. There will be no definitive numbers with respect to damaged properties and affected people until that assessment has been completed. However, we know a number of households self-evacuated as a result of the storm. If people are in need of shelter or support, they can report to the Auckland Council building at 6 Henderson Valley Road, where they'll be triaged appropriately. And of course, staff there are doing all they can to maintain uh, public health protocols as much as they can. But we are being pragmatic. Emergency situations and evacuation advice overrides alert level requirements. The most important thing is keeping people safe. If you're advised to evacuate by authorities because of an emergency, please follow that advice. And of course we understand that the situation will mean that there will be some bubbles who by necessity are joining other families simply because they need shelter. Please call 111 if life, health or property is in danger. Emergency services continue to operate. Check Met Service uh, online for the latest on weather for your region, your local council or civil defence group website for instructions and advice, and NZTA for any road closures. Now two drive-through vaccination centres, Trust Arena and Airport Park and Ride, they closed temporarily due to the impacts from the storm, but both have now reopened. The airport park and ride drive through vaccination centre in Mangere reopened shortly after 9am after two marquees uh, that had come down were re-erected and repositioned in order to restart vaccinations. The Trust Arena drive through site moved inside for the day and reopened at 10.30. People will be directed to park on site and asked to enter the stadium to be vaccinated rather than stay in their vehicles. The usual drive through model we expect will reopen tomorrow. Anyone who was impacted by the late opening was not able to attend their appointment this morning will be contacted to reschedule their bookings for later in the week. Finally, I know for Aucklanders this weather event must feel like another blow at an already incredibly difficult time and some of the damage I've seen to people's homes is just devastating. Please do look after yourselves, do reach out for help and support, it is available to you.